Mm. No, it ain't. Mm. You see, the dominant narrative is your sticker. The dominant narrative in America is white people are evil, white people suck, we should be ashamed of ourselves. And I don't think we, we should are... be ashamed of ourselves. I think that we should take responsibility for the system that we've created. The best system in the world? We do not have the best system Who in the world. Who has a better system? <laughs> there are many European countries that have are much better off oh, than Oh, you us. mean like the European countries with a higher density of whites, like Northern Europe? <laughs> uh, that's one way to phrase it, I guess. You don't mean Turkey. <laughs> no. You don't mean Eastern Europe no. with the communists. So the only time you can come up with a system that's better than America, it's a country that's more white than America. I don't I, understand. I don't, I don't know what to say to that. So, like, I, I just want to know where the data is that supports this universe of white supremacy. Is it because whites are doing well? <laughs> um, that makes it sound like whites are doing well because um, they earned it and they did all the right things rather than we've built this country on a system for hundreds of years that that allows whites to do well. We have generations that have supported our success and we have taken away support from communities of color. So that is why communities of color are not doing well in America. It's not because white people are doing so well for themselves. We, we're just such a great people. I mean, I'm not... So the reason whites are, are doing well is because we cheated. Yeah. But if you look at the data of Asians, for example, you will find way more Asian privilege than there is white privilege. Asians make way more money than whites. They're way more educated than whites. They are less likely to experience any kind of crime than whites are. They're less likely to die at work than whites are. I mean, the list goes on. Yeah, they suffer from a different sort of um, racial stereotyping. Well, they don't suffer. They're kicking our ass. Asian, everything you can say about white privilege is more true with Asian privilege. No one grabs their it still purse when it... pigeonholes them. Pardon? It still pigeonholes them. Pigeonholes them as successful? I don't think anyone minds being pigeonholed like that. Hey, Mr. No, Successful, I'm, why don't you go drive a nice car? It's not near as harmful as how black folks are stereotyped, certainly. Okay, so uh, why don't you start at the top then and let's try to dismantle Asian privilege. Asian privilege, I wouldn't call it Asian privilege. Well, it fits all the criteria of white male privilege. What do you mean by that? Uh, they get better jobs, they get better educations, they don't, no one th sees them as threatening, uh... Everything that you can say that whites mm. cheated to get is pr more prevalent in an Asian society. Okay, let's drop yeah. that. I guess it's not going anywhere. <laughs>